Hello everyone, how are you all doing? In this video, we are going to talk about the iOS 18 Beta 2 and before talking about the iOS 18 Beta 2, we are going to talk about that during the end of this video. So make sure to watch till the end. We are going to talk about the iOS 18 Beta 1 and basically this is a follow up plus iOS 18 Beta 2 preview video. We are going to discuss how has been the iOS 18 beta 1 performing since I've installed it on my device as it's been way over a week that I have been using my device on iOS 18 beta 1. We are going to talk about that briefly and we are going to talk about what all new features and changes are expected to arrive on iOS 18 beta 2. And we are also going to talk about the release date of iOS 18 beta 2 most importantly. My name is Jay, you are watching Tech Hype. If you are new here, consider hitting that subscribe button because I keep on making these type of videos for you guys and I don't want you guys to miss these. Let's get right into this video. Alright, let's talk about iOS 18 beta 1 and the number one thing that we are going to talk about is the performance. How has been the iOS 18 beta 1 performing since I've installed it on my devices? The best device that is performing and the latest device that I own which has iOS 18 beta 1, you all know that it is the iPhone 14 Pro. So my iPhone 14 Pro on the iOS 18 beta 1 is performing really really good as expected. It is not lagging, it is having the iOS 18 beta 1 and it is running it like a champ. The only issue that I have in terms of performance on iOS 18 beta 1 is that it sometimes get really warm compared to earlier like abnormally warm not overheating but abnormally warm it never got this warm my iphone 14 pro is getting a bit too hot lately since i installed the ios 18 beta 1 then talking about the iphone 11 the iphone 11 is also performing pretty decently it is not performing the best it is not performing really bad it is performing pretty average it, you can use it and you it won't really give you any headache as such but yeah there is a delay and it does take abnormally longer times to load up apps compared to earlier but this is pretty normal for a beta so i am not going to complain a lot about it all right let's talk about the biggest thing that you guys are here for before talking about the ios 18 beta 2 that is the battery life. The battery life on iOS 18 beta 1 has been pretty bad actually. Yeah, iOS 18 beta 1 is performing really bad in terms of battery screen on time. We all are aware that iOS 17.5.1 onwards, it was really bad. The battery life has been really bad in general. And iOS 18 beta 1, since it is a beta, I won't complain that much. But yeah, still, screen on time got over one hour less compared to iOS 17.5.1 on all of my devices. For example, I was getting over six hours on my iPhone 11 before installing the iOS 18 update. And now I'm getting five hours 10 minutes of screen on time like almost an hour cut in terms of screen on time usage and on my iphone 14 pro i was getting over seven hours and now i'm getting six hours of screen on time battery life has been pretty bad and uh, to be very honest i don't have high expectations but uh, yeah i just wanted to share it with you guys because a lot of you guys wanted to install ios 18 beta 1 on your device and was wondering that how is the battery life so here is it it is pathetic and talking about the new control center after using the new control center for the past couple of days i have came to this conclusion that i really really love it but it is still not perfect it needs a lot of refinements and bug fixes it does bug out a lot of times in my usage if you guys do follow me on my twitter at the rate tech hype the link is below the like button there are a lot of pretty small bugs and issues here and there with the control center which i think should be resolved as soon as possible but yeah ios 18 beta 1 control center I would rate it a solid 8.5 out of 10 in terms of my experience. And to be honest, I have a hope that they will still give more options in the control center. I just feel like it is a bit incomplete. We are probably going to see something. Yeah, something else coming up in our control center soon. 
fingers crossed anyways we are also probably gonna see new wallpapers coming up on the ios 18 really really soon there is a possibility that before the beta 5 we are gonna have some new wallpapers on our iphone so that is a great news and now that we have talked about new wallpapers let's jump to the segment of this video that is ios 18 beta 2 when is apple going to release the ios 18 beta 2 that is a question for the day and uh, i'm here to answer it so today the day i'm recording this video and posting this video it is 20th june thursday and we have been using the ios 18 beta 1 for more than a week it's been roughly 10 days that we have been using the ios 18 so if history is an indication we are probably gonna see the ios 18 beta 2 the following week that means we are going to see ios 18 beta 2 really really soon next week is the time so anytime between 25 to 27 are the times that we are going to see ios 18 beta 2 dropping up on our devices i am really excited for ios 18 beta 2 and i know you guys are as well so make sure to hit that subscribe button because i am one of the first person who is coming up with the content of ios 18 for you guys so hit that subscribe button right now if you haven't already ios 18 beta 2 is probably gonna not arrive with new wallpapers yet we do have some hope for the new wallpapers until the beta 5 if we got the new wallpapers by beta 5 that is amazing but if we don't receive any new wallpapers until the beta 5 then just kill your hopes because we are probably not going to get any new wallpapers after then then talking about the new features we are definitely going to see more and new features coming up on ios 18 betas every beta will definitely bring more and more new features to our devices and i'm really looking forward and excited for it because there aren't anything majorly new on ios 18 what i mean by that is that there are still a lot of features that are yet to arrive and trust me we are gonna have a lot of fun as soon as we are going to approach september and the ios 18 goes public we are going to get a lot of new features and a lot of new hidden features as well so you know what to do hit that subscribe button right now if you haven't already well, that's pretty much it for today's video thank you so much for watching this video we are going to see ios 18 beta 2 arriving next week that means we are less than a week away from ios 18 beta 2 we are going to see a lot of new features and changes coming up to ios 18 beta 2 fingers crossed the only new thing that i want is stability and bug fixes and battery improvements would be definitely appreciated apple well that's pretty much it for today's video thank you so much for watching this video till the end this is me jay aka tech hyped and i am signing off peace out and have a great day everyone